Hi, Jane Edmondson here. Each year, about 500 billion litres of stormwater is washed off our roofs, driveways and roads when it rains. With each major rain event, stormwater flows with great speed and velocity into our local waterways, causing damage to the habitat and carrying with it many harmful pollutants, such as chemicals, sediment and excess nutrients. Too much stormwater has a negative effect on the health of our rivers, creeks and bays. Luckily, there's a solution to help solve this problem. They're known as rain gardens and they take many forms, from planter boxes to properly diverted downpipes onto a garden bed. They are typically made up of different layers of rock mulch, sand and soil and are designed to filter and slow down the rate of stormwater. So, how does a typical rain garden work? 1. Stormwater is redirected from the roof or other hard surfaces and into a rain garden. 2. The water slows down and spreads throughout the rain garden where plants use up the nutrients. 3. The water then seeps down through the layers of the rain garden, filtering out sediments and pollutants. 4. The filtered stormwater is collected in pipes and a lot less of it flows to our local waterways. Melbourne Water has been working with local councils and the community to create rain gardens in public spaces such as streets, parks and schools. They're now expanding the program so that everyone can play their part at home. Not only can you help protect the health of the waterways, you can also create a low-maintenance, self-watering garden that will thrive in all climates. Register your rain garden on the website to be part of the count towards 10,000 rain gardens across Melbourne. Just visit melbournewater.com.au slash rain gardens or call 131 722. It could be a win for you, your garden and our waterways.